hello everyone in this video we are going to learn three things about the adobe indesign the first thing is how we can import a single page pdf in adobe indesign how we can import multi pages pdf in adobe indesign and how to import a pdf having multiple orientations which means that some pages have horizontal orientation and some have the vertical orientation how we can import these pdf in the adobe indesign so just to start with let's suppose i have created a blank document in adobe indesign so i have to import a single page pdf in adobe indesign first so what i have to do i have to go to file place and from here i can select let's suppose this pdf and you can see that i have placed this pdf in the first page now the thing to think is that this pdf was a multi-page pdf but why it showed only a single page and there was no option shown to import the other pages of the pdf so let's do once one more time go to file place select the file and from here you can see show import options when you click on this show import option it will show you some other options which include the previewed page if you want to import all the pages if you want to import a certain range of the pdf in adobe indesign let's suppose i want to import two pages or let's say three pages starting from two to four okay and click ok now here is the second page that i clicked here here is the third page and here is the fourth page now we have imported the multi-page pdf in adobe indesign but the thing is that they are not scaled up to their dimensions according to the page size let's suppose if your document is of a4 size so you have to make sure that your pdf is also of a4 size otherwise you will have to adjust it and it will going to take a lot of time and you have to import the pages by clicking one by one in the adobe indesign so let's suppose if you are going to import a pdf of let's say 100 pages so it will going to take a lot of time so let's let's learn something new so first thing is that you need to know what is the dimension of your pdf let's suppose i'm going to import this pdf in adobe indesign that i have created in adobe illustrator so from here i can check that my pdf dimensions are 21 by 30 so when i create a document so i will put in the dimensions the height the height as 30.66 and the width is 21 and now i create a document once i've created a document i do not need to create 100 pages if i have i am going to import 100 pages pdf for that purpose i have to use a script let's see how it works go to windows utilities and go to script let me collapse everything so you will see something like this from here you need to go into the samples then the javascript and in, in the javascript you will find an option of place multiple pages pdf right click on the multiple pdf and now import any report or you want to and select the untitled one one that we have just created and click ok now it will ask on which page number you want to place the pdf let's suppose if you are placing the pdf in some existing document let's suppose you want to start from the page number 12 so from here you can select the page number 12 and you can place the pdf from here but for that for now we have only page one so select one and click ok so you will see that it has automatically placed all the pages in adobe indesign according to the exact dimension and i do not have to click manually to place each and every page in the adobe indesign like it has created a magic and place the pdf throughout the document okay now the third thing if we want to import a multi-page pdf that has multiple orientation that is some pages are horizontal and some pages are vertical so how we are going to do that so let's suppose i am going to i want to insert multi-page pdf at page number six right so for that purpose i have to clear, create only one blank page uh, that is created on page number seven i want to start from page number seven so go to window utilities scripts place multi-page pdf and select a document that has multiple orientation okay and now it will ask that from, from which page number you want to get started so i will place page number seven as i want to start the pages from page number seven and click okay okay now you can clearly see that it has placed the document from page number seven eight nine ten it was four pages pdf so it has generated three more pages to place all the four pages of the pdf okay now the point of concern is that this page and this page has a horizontal orientation so it is not getting fixed in the pages properly so for that purpose what you need to do you have to create one new parent pages click new parent name it as parent b and you can change the orientation in, into landscape now this is the new orientation of your parent so on the pages that were page number 9 and 10 has a horizontal orientation you can simply drag it on page number 9 click on the use parent page size and similarly for the left hand side drag it on the page number 10 now if you go to page number 8 and 9 and 10 you can see that 
the pages are properly arranged as per their page sizes that has the vertical orientation so it is fixed in the portrait orientation this has the landscape orientation so it has been fixed in the landscape orientation so that was a simple procedure to import single page pdf multi-page pdf and multi-pages pdf having different orientation i hope you must have liked this video